Hey guys, it's me, Drew. Now it's time for part two of my Witch Baby Soap order. This is more scrubs, as well as some other backups. So I'm going to start with backups of stuff that I already did a haul on in the previous order. This is two more orders combined that I placed. So I also, I got another Hellamus bath bomb because I love it so much. See, why does my camera do this? So Hellamus bath bomb. There we go. And it's like a pumpkin vanilla type of scent. I really, really like it. And then I also ordered another initiation bath bomb, which, so now I have uh, two of these. This is the, or do I have three? Two or three, something like that. And this is a scent of like a bonfire and crunched leaves and all that goodness. I also, if you remember, I talked about the salve, the hand salve that I really liked. I also picked that up in this order. So the initiation hand salve. This one does not want to focus. My camera sucks. <laughs> so this is the initiation hand salve. Also smells amazing. So this is almost like a deep, deep, rich hand cream. Almost like a hand oil, but it absorbs beautifully. And it's a nice, it's a nice size. I really like that. So I ordered that as well. And I also ordered two of the initiation soaps. I think I meant to order two initiation bath bombs, but I ordered two of the soaps by accident. Not a big deal. I love the way that it smells, and I love the way that the soap looks. So those are two initiation soaps as well. Then I ordered, oh, the free sample in one of the orders was the Old Wise Man Soap, which is like a men's psychic scent, is what it used to be called. It's like a cologne type scent. So cool and then use the code abracadabra for 5% off your next order I also ordered speaking of backups this scrub I placed in one order the harvest ceremony body scrub it's apples chestnuts and maple and can you take a look and see how beautiful this scrub is it's like orangey and green rich and sweet this blend calls for a celebration roasted chestnuts caramelized apples muscovado sugar and freshly tapped maple syrup dance together and warm up the coldest of autumn days sea salt and natural clays give this body scrub a deep detoxifying exfoliation made with deeply nourishing shea butter coconut oil and grapeseed oil this body scrub is a necessity for the coldest autumn day i love body scrubs I can go through body scrubs really quick. I just love to super scrub my body. Um, I used this on my hands just once just to try it out and fell in love with it instantly. I wanted to buy a backup. So I have two of these for this autumn season. Um, this actually expires August 29th of 2018. So maybe using this one um, this autumn and then saving this right when I'm like ready for fall next year in like September and be like, yes, or not September, August. So those are those. Then I also ordered, I talked about this in my last order, this is the Hecate or Hecate face soap, which is like the pumpkin face soap. I'm really excited to try this. Don't know a whole lot about it. Haven't heard many reviews, so I'm excited to give that a shot, and it's a face wash. I then ordered a Hexbreaker soap because I had a sample of that in one of my videos, and I really liked it, and it's just a pure black charcoal soap. I really, really liked it, so I wanted to order one of those. I also ordered the Batwoman soap, which has like an image of a Batwoman. Really, really cool. So see, this is a pretty good, you can see how it's like clear soap at the top so you can see the image and it literally just washes away as you wash your body. Really cool. And this is pear scented. The Hexbreaker scent is like, um, just really fresh lime. Actually, <laughs> it's a funny story. I have the Hexbreaker body scrub I bought too. Hexbreaker can banish even the darkest of days with exfoliating sea salt, detoxifying charcoal, and deeply moisturizing shea butter and avocado oil. Lemon is the star of this clarifying blend. It's exfoliating, clarifying, and great for scrubbing away negative energy. Hexbreaker is great for all skin types, but especially acne-prone skin, as we formulated this blend with non-communogenic oils and fresh lemon puree. Calming lavender, soothing clary sage, clary sage, and hex-breaking angelica oils round out this blend with extra curse-breaking and protective properties. Apply to skin in circular motions and rinse away all the negativity. And this scrub, I don't know if you can see, it literally like is like a powder scrub. So it's going to be beautiful. And it smells so fresh. It's like lemon and sage. It's really yummy. Like you're going to cook or make soup or something with it. It smells really good. 
And then I got the matching soap. I also got my Hallow Mess, which I love, bath bomb and everything. I got it in a body scrub. And this is really heavy. I don't know why it's so heavy. And this is packed with pumpkins and cinnamon and pumpkin fruit and all sorts of good things. But I cannot get it open. I opened it once and I guess I must have put the lid on too tight. So well, at least I know it's fresh. <laughs> um... Then I picked up the Magic Beach Body Scrub, which is sea salt, lime, and agave. This is just very, very fresh lime. And just super fresh lime and salt. I really like it with a little bit of sweetness. This is part of her summer line, so it was on sale. I just have been eyeing it up. That and Dream Palace, but Dream Palace is sold out. So, picked this one up because I wanted to try it. Then I got the Witch's Woods Body Scrub, which I got in my spell box, and I used it up right away. It's a shimmery body scrub. If you've used the um, Lush um, body conditioners, how you rinse them off, or the scrubby, and you rinse it off and you're left super, super soft and hydrated, this is very similar. You can really feel the moisture, except it leaves you shimmery too, which is pretty cool. Who doesn't want to be a little bit glittery, right? Mm -hmm. Next is the love body scrub roses apples and magic and this guy is applesauce based so i already used this all over my body once but as you can see it's so like rich and emollient that as soon as you know you let it sit level it just goes right back to being flat i am obsessed with the way that this smells it smells like apples and roses really simple like fresh macintosh apples and like pink roses I love the way that smells, and it's super, super scrubby. One more soap. I actually, this is a pretty quick video. Is the Mischief Night Soap. And I'm not even 100% what this smells like. This was a throwback Thursday, and I was just like, I'm going to add one more little item into my order. The problem with Witch Baby, it's pretty inexpensive. So you're like, oh, what's $4? What's $4? And then your bill's like $100. And you're like, oh, yeah, yeah. So this is like a full moon with a little bat in it. I thought this was like going to be great for Halloween. I think it's like apples or candy corn or something. I'm not positive. So there's that. The last is a duo of the same smell. This is the Caffeomancy Body Scrub Autumn Edition. So this is coffee, whipped cream, bourbon vanilla, pumpkin, and maple syrup. It smells so good. I used this scrub yesterday. Can you see that? It is like gooey, gooey, gooey. You can really pick up the coffee, but it's not like disgusting coffee it's like coffee grind coffee pumpkin maple syrup it smells so so freaking good and exfoliated really nice you rinsed it off and you weren't greasy at all you were just super soft and super hydrated so now i have eight body scrubs i think i'm pretty stocked up for now and then i also got the cafe mancy autumn edition body butter this is in the thick whip now i have the halimus body butter in the air whip version and i'm like i pick the air whip because i think her body butters can be a little greasy this uh, air whip is extremely greasy you put it on and it even says uh store in a cool dry place apply with clean dry hands and allow up to 10 minutes for it to fully absorb and work its magic but it's just like super greasy like super greasy and i'm like why did i order the thick whip i said i'm gonna try it if i don't like it i'll give it to somebody that's why i only ordered one of the body butters um, hello, this is the Thick Whip. I put this on my skin, it melts right in, and within, like, a minute, I feel comfortable. It's weird, I don't feel greasy at all. So I don't know, why would the Thick Whip, that's literally, like, you have to break into it. Why would this Thick Whip be not as greasy as the Air Whip? I don't get that logic, but that's my logic. Can you see? Here's the air whip. Can you see? It's like moussey, right? You would think that this melts right in, but it actually makes you more greasy. So, I don't know the story behind this. Maybe it's just all in my head, but we'll see. But anyway, that was my small-ish... Oh, one more thing. The best thing, I think, in this whole order is the graveyard body oil. It smells of flowers and dirt, but... That's not the best. It actually got settled because it was sitting on my desk for a few days. Let me give this a quick shake. And then you can admire the Graveyard Body Oil. Loaded with shimmer.
which just makes it beautiful and gorgeous. My computer went to sleep like it always does. But yes, beautiful and gorgeous. I'm obsessed, obsessed with this glitter. I can't even, and it smells so good. It smells like fresh flowers and dirt. Who doesn't want to smell like that? No, I'm sure a lot of people don't, but I love the way that it smells. So that was my Witch Baby Soap haul. I know, crazy, a ton, a ton of stuff. Um, I do have one more midsize order coming, and then I'm good until the next collection comes out. So thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye!